Hello and welcome everyone, Lanhart here with part 3 of the Danes Let's Play of Total War Attila. We continue where we left it off last time and we've pushed out to hit the Rugians. It looks like, um, well, margin of error, we would just about win this. Um, we're going to fight it. We're going to see if we can win. They've got a crap load of hurlers and it's going to be well-timed cavalry strikes which are either going to win me this or lose. They've got I think they'll have four towers in this fort. You'll see on the map in a moment, it's, it's a circular fort. I assume this is the barbarian style fort in uh, Attila. Uh, Roman ones seem to be the standard square. I don't know if there's a different one for Easterns as well, but it seems like you've kind of got three different cultures there. Uh, although, I don't know, maybe there's a different one as well for, like, bar, well, horde. Like, I guess, Eastern horde factions, such as, like, well, I say Eastern. I mean, like, the Steppe Horde faction, so the Huns, if they have their own unique one, or what their encampments look like. Uh, we're going to try and push in from various sides, but th the problem is I'm going to need to try and take some towers down. They have their Onigas over here, and I'm going to... You know what, first of all, I was talking about those well-timed cavalry strikes. I'm actually going to see if I can take out their Onigar first. Just because, if not, that's going to threaten my on and then I won't be able to take out their towers at all. So we're going to get these guys ready. They're just going to go straight on in, hit the on get out, hopefully. Uh, this on is going to deploy here, and we're going to try and push it forward. We're going to put it on flaming shot, so it can try and take out that watchtower. It's got a bonus. As far as I know, that's not less accurate. If anyone can confirm that for me, then feel free. But yeah, it doesn't seem like they're any less accurate or, or what have you. Put those guys over here. Spears attacking in from over here. We'll have the javelins. Group 4 going in over here. We'll have them in loose spacing as well, in case we don't take all the towers down. Archers, depending on how successful my onager is, I'm going to put you on flaming shot for now. You may well be changed to go on to take down tower detail. We'll see. Uh, and I'll have my general behind these guys as well, behind the swords. Right. Here we go. In fact... No, let's... Let's try and take out the tower first. Let's ignore their Onager. Just try and get forward a little bit. In comes my cavalry. I'm just hoping they won't notice. They do have one or two units of spears. Hit that tower. Here we go, because I'm, I'm putting two units of cavalry to charge in here. I know I could just send the one, but I want enough strength to actually get through and hit that Onaga. And they're already forming up. Well, they're already trying to hit me with that Onaga, and they're already trying to belay that. Oh no, one got in fine. Okay, other unit of cavalry, you're going to come back. Because you've already taken heavy losses. I need these guys broken and dead, though. Oh, wow, that's, that's a bug. Um, we've not hit that once yet. Let's see if it's any more accurate. Let's try and hit it. Okay, my cavalry broke. No way of saving them. That crew could come back. Here these come, here these come, here these come. Oh, that did clip the side of the tower. Didn't seem much more accurate though. So we'll put it back to flaming. It looks like their AI is pushing out. Okay, now this is, this is some, something that's I've seen people complain about so far on the forums. And that actually is seemingly quite common. That unfortunately the AI seems to push out more than it should in this situation to defend. Yes, tower's down. Good. Okay, in that case we're going to try and take out their general now. Spears, come forward here. Javelins. You don't need to be in loose formation now. Just, just just, form up here. I know you're potentially still in range of some of the towers, but you shouldn't be too badly in range. Unless they decide to go back on in. So I think actually my cavalry charge may have kind of forced them into action a little bit, which is fine by me. Rather than them turtling up there. That may have actually been it. They just need to know to react differently in that situation, though. 
Oh, we set the whole wall on fire so we could just pile through a whole gap, I would assume. Unless there's going to be an impassable barrier still. Let's try some manual Lionheart fail shots. Come on. Come on. Get me a good kill. That's right in there. That wasn't a fail. Good. If I can snipe out their general. Morale penalties for all. Burn, baby, burn. I think I need to aim slightly a smidge back. Let's try there. That's gonna miss. No, I'll still get a few. How's that? Oh, no, they're running. Don't think that's far enough. But on the right track. This is last shot. I need to turn my flaming arrows off on my men. All that. No, it's just this. Archers, go to normal shot, please. Cavalry, go in here. You guys, charge. You guys, charge. Right, then now they're all attacking in the same place. General punch on in. Their general's away from their main force, so that's good. I'm going to see if normal... Yeah, normal will do. That's less armor-piercing. That does... Armor-piercing damage, really? Flaming round. Okay, fine, we'll leave that on. Oh, look at that charge, and we come. That's nice. Sorry that one of you had to be sacrificed. Oh, we've mobbed them there. We've had them there, lad. Right. Push forward, skirmishers. Get around, support these guys. Support these guys. Turn and support these guys. General hit here. All their slingers are running. Yeah, unfortunately my cab. Yeah, couldn't get them. Pull these guys back. I know the hurlers are going to come and hit me, but we don't want to get too close to them. Oh no, that has not. Um, can we walk over that? I don't know, but it has burnt it down. One of you turn around quickly. Clip them there. You guys charge in here. Cavalry, you're back. Charge, charge, charge. You guys... Flee, flee, flee. You guys go, go, go. Archers, archers, archers. Go kill their general. Cavalry's piled back on in, but I think we've lost the cavalry now. Yeah, we got these guys. Just make sure they're completely dead, though. Skirmishers should have that, though. Take these guys all down, then we're pushing on that lot there. I think we got this. Taking lots of losses, but I kind of expect that when I'm in a battle like this. Not gonna lie, let's let's take these guys out. Hit the skirmishers. They're gone. Skirmishers all on slingers. Central troops to kill their general. General, get out of there because I don't want to lose you. You're being hit by hurlers. Yeah. Charging on this lot. These guys are doing pretty well holding. Oh, that volley or two just got these guys down. Right, take them out there. Take them out there. Push in. If we can break their general, they should all break now. General, I think you're safe enough to push up. Oh, come on, be able to catch them. Be able to catch them. That'll hurt. They're exhausted. Let's go for these guys now. Come on, come on, let me intimidate. Oh, he's broken. Kill their general, kill their general. Get me a kill. 
Actually helped taking out that front tower. Now it's just the rest of them here. Take out the next one. Come on. Uh, flaming arrows back on. Lower their morale. They'll break. That's the plan anyway. Punch, 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 punch. Here we go. Flaming shot. Finish them off. Makes them all break. It's just these guys up here that we need them to break. There we go. That's a win. I think. No, these guys have come back. No, oh, they're still there as well. Nice, mass volley. Get off the slot, come on. They've all gone. After these guys. And I'm running again. I need to stop running so much. Because that ties them all out. There we go. Oh, thank crap for that. I'm ending it because I don't want to get taken out by any more towers. Oh, yeah. That cost us. It cost us a lot. Hopefully we'll be able to replenish up. I'm hoping this is the end of this army. It's fortified. I don't think they can retreat from. So that should have finished them all off anyway. If not, there's only 356 remaining. No, they still live, annoyingly. Got one of my units of cav, which is... is yeah. That's what we'd be expected. Oh, damn, they're going to flee. I just want to kill you. And I can kill you. And I'm going to take the attrition to go kill them. Uh, just auto resolve aggressive. Right through the neck. Lovely. And we will replenish. Enemy killed in battle. Nice. Um... And I am probably then going to take attrition again, but I'm going to flee back here. Ready for battle. Just to replenish back up and force march. Uh, right, we probably should get something that resembles an economic building, because my economy is awful right now. Um, that's not really going to help us much. We need to get onto that. Nordic Warriors is what I want to go for. Eventually. Upgrade them. Uh, we'll also, yeah... But I think we should probably get a few of these bits. Construction cost. Wealth agricultural buildings. <clears throat> Commercial. Bonus sacred king. Uh, wealth from animal husbandry. Just lets me get more buildings really that are going to... Well, we'll go for that to start with. Might as well. Um, yeah, where's our... Let me check my treasury here. Uh, it's our navy. That's why. And I'm chasing these guys pathetically up here. I shouldn't. Have, I should not have chased them, as you guys said in the last video. Like I missed an opportunity to potentially hit these guys here uh, and take them out. But I'm just giving them time to build up. So hopefully next time we can just at least kill their hiking, and then we'll we'll see what we can go do. Right, my general leveled up, and we've also got army traditions to give now. So uh, food is fine. Sacking and looting income bonuses is always nice, but I'm going to. Uh, that's governed. So infantry recruits. I think there was more defense. Cavalry, a war chief, the commanded force. We've got to get all of those though to be able to get that. Uh, melee defense. What about integrity and corruption? No, it's more for a governor really. So for a general. Uh, we'll go for that, and then we'll go for the sacking bonus. Then for traditions, uh, I'm thinking could go for integrity, morale during forest battles, Romans, nomadic tribes, nomadic tribes, or would be pretty good. But also growth for local province, useful and wealth, and that's a just an army tradition. So I don't, yeah. So we'll go for this. I think that's going to help out. Hopefully, yeah, a little bit of extra money. Way. Uh, we should really put these guys into a raiding stance too. I'll disband some bits after this. Actually, in fact, let's merge. Yeah, actually, that merge button is actually quite awful. Oh, you just want to hit Control M repeatedly, and it'll do them all. There we go. Economy's back up, and we know what we'll disband this weakened ship. Save us a bit more. There we go. Economy's not so bad. So have a look at diplomacy. Um, we geeks, you want trade? To your ah, come on. 
Um, arrange marriage. Demand wife for my governor. Okay, okay, okay. Um, Energy access. Military oh. access is a. Okay, we will offer you. No, I will ask for a trade agreement. And I'm going to offer you some money. Seriously, I'm prepared to offer like 600. Six hundred. Nope. Nope. Then are we? It's deteriorating. Why? Military action against the Rugians. They don't like that. They don't like raiding and blockading the Jutes. Didn't mean to do that. If that was the case. Sorry. A Saxons. A tongue that speaks without wisdom is not welcome. Be like a spear. Oh crap! What did Much I just do? A you will be swelled thanks to your words of agreement. My thanks. What do I just do? I just agreed to marry Greetings someone, didn't I? You. I trust you come with honor. Oh no, they've agreed to go to war for probably some money. Yeah, like 200. I was just clicking through so quickly, I was like, ah! Okay, well that, that's that's cool. That's great, Saxons, that you're now... It's improving. Blockading and raiding. Sorry. Um, but, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Fair enough. Um, these guys, do you want to trade? You are welcome. All okay, right. We'll end that. And we're just going to end the turn. I should also say apologies if um, you can hear a, my mouse clicks a bit more pronounced. Uh, this part, I'm actually using a slightly different mouse today. And um, its clicks are a bit louder than my previous ones. So if that's really bugging you, do let me know. If it's okay and not too bad, then again, let me know. Really appreciate it. <sighs> but it's comfy, so it's good. But um, I will change back to the other one if it's too noisy. Right, mission is sealed. Cool, they're about to die anyway. Oh, seriously? Oh, what the? What the? <laughs> what the hell? He just went around in a circle. I'm gonna, I'm gonna order his over that one with an aggressive charge to his face. That was the weirdest thing I've ever seen. Um, we're going to do a little replenish. And there we go, he's dead. And we gained a thousand, yeah. And their faction's destroyed, the Varians. Cool, so we're now going to... Sail down here. Sail down here. All I should have done was combine these guys. There we go. Right, all of you lot in that ship. You can now be disbanded. There we go. I was hoping I might be able to see what they've got here. But no. Okay, we can upgrade our undeveloped land. Cool, we need something that's going to earn us some money. The goat herd, the food is fine. Jetty is good. Um, we could go obviously for something to get us more troops. That's going to get us Onager and Nordic bows. That's getting us Nordic mounted raiders. Uh, so we don't have any infantry melee, melee types. Chieftain's House will allow us to get some, I believe, some herdmen or the artisan for Nordic brigade. 300 wealth from industry. That's a public order bonus as well. What's our public order like here without the military presence? Yeah, probably could do with that. So we'll go for the Chieftain's House this time round. Uh, they're all replenishing. Normal stance, if you don't mind. And technology's going there, so that's okay. We might be worth getting the steel forge. 
and the smithy upkeep cost for melee infantry. Why have I not got that yet? Okay, next turn. After we finish. Researching that civic technology, we are going to be going for that upkeep reduction. Should be good. How are you guys? Uh, how are you guys finding Attila so far, or gals as well? Um, how are you finding it so far, difficulty-wise, um, balancing? Um, I know, obviously, we're still waiting for optimization and drivers. Do do do. Uh, but hopefully we'll get those soon. He's ready for duty, yeah, because I disbanded him. But yeah, how are you? How are you finding things apart from those issues? Which hopefully we'll get something this week. I'm hoping. Okay, what's their garrison like? Uh, we'll see what chance we have when we actually assault them. Oh, we do not have a good chance. Wow, really? Uh, I guess I don't have that many men, so we can maintain a blockade though. Or we could we could raid them. But who else is in this? Who gets trade from here? The Geats. So the Geats going to be pissed if I start raiding them. Is deteriorating anyway. It's going to start going. Uh, we've got a non-aggression pact. We have need of talk. I'm sure. Oh, there we go. Now they, now you accept trade. What was all that about before then? Can I have that woman as well? Friend. I've called for oh. good ale to ease Is she your gone? Throat or was it not you I was talking to? Dukes. Welcome. No. Saxons, that's what it was. But we'll leave them. Um, yeah, so we'll just, we'll just blockade these guys for a few turns. We'll let these guys replenish up and then we'll. Uh, we can't go through that way, so we'll have to sail along the coast and land. Oh, uh, no. Uh, well, no, we could land over. No, we couldn't. We're going to have to go through their land. There's cliffs everywhere. Or we arrive by sea and attack as well. That actually wouldn't be. That'd be fine, because in Attila, actually, your cavalry still deploy on land anyway. So, not a problem. Let's do that then. So, it's going to be a couple of end turns to get through and see how it goes. Do, do, do. Okay, what's going on there? Angles causing some trouble. Do do do. A matter of state, a border dispute. Lothar. Yeah, aren't you one of my generals? Um, oh yeah, Lothar here. This guy. Nope. This guy. Lothar. Uh, but it's fine. It's the, uh, just the same name. So, uh, along the borders of our nation, a farmer from the neighbouring state is claiming land belonging to one of ours is his own. Ignore it. Take back the land by force. Such acts can spark wider political trouble. Send in the troops and settle the matter. Uh, or buy the land. Make the funds available. Um, yeah, you know, we'll buy the land rather than being bloodthirsty Vikings and throwing in men to cause more trouble. So 
So yeah, there we go. Well, that's about to increase there. These guys can be increased to ship commander and ship commander because, well, you're in charge of my navy, so you might as well have those traits. Um, recruitment for range morale versus barbarian kingdoms. Sorry, Javier, you're uh, plus 10% from immigration, Gavin Province. And uh, no, we'll go for a barbarian turncoat, though. So, building the slot up. Can we get more cav? No, because they were from over here. Damn. Might have to stop off there first and get some more cavalry. Let's uh, let's jump over there first, actually, because, yeah, our economy's okay. We're at 92 happiness anyway, and that when that comes in next turn, that'll help with stuff. Up your pop. Get me another unit of dem cav, please. Right, they're mustering them. Everyone's replenishing. We're just holding up here. They're, they're annoyingly, they, they can build troops when you're... I oh know, so I'm not besieging them. I'm just uh, hitting them. So, actually, let's, let's retreat. I know it's going to pee off the geats, but... Well, actually, as long as I don't go on their trade route, then I shouldn't annoy them. Which will obviously, it would get me more money, but this shouldn't annoy, have annoyed them. No, there we go. So I haven't raided. As long as I don't go on their trade route, so I can just raid in here because it's... Well, I mean, technically that's a bit, but their port's over here, so that's fine. Fleet ready. And I should be able to blockade while doing that as well. No, damn, the blockading action. I thought that might actually work. It didn't. It did not. And now... <laughs> Now, <laughs> now I can't raid. Uh, you know, I'm just going to go back and blockade. blockade. I thought that might work. I thought I might be able to be raiding in that stance and attacking, but no. So we'll just blockade them. <laughs> right, end turn again before we probably bring things to a close for this part. Um, I should say, if no, not this one, actually. I was thinking of part four. This is part three. I'm getting ahead of myself, so I will tell you what I was thinking in part four. But yeah, I hope, hope you guys are enjoying these Let's Plays so far. I know they're a bit different. They're probably... I know I'm playing at a slower pace, just I'm quite cautious because, well... The Hunt Let's Play, I am getting my ass handed to me at the moment. I'm making, like, two sets forward and then three back. So I need to work out a way to rally that somehow. That's going to be tough. But this is probably one of the most challenging Total War games I've played in a long time. Oh, seriously? I don't think it'd be that much. Uh, it's the most profitable compromise. I don't think so. I don't feel like it was profitable. She was sending the freaking troops. Oh, they sent a spy against me. Warriors all. Right, I am going to. Force march my guys over here. I know they haven't completely healed up, but. They're going to have a lot of horses now. Horses? Forces. Um, I know we've got the navy coming in as well. We've got these guys to bombard the city with, so we can set it all on fire. We should be able to do that if we can climb up, but we'll wait until next next turn when it's not winter. What are the benefits of blockading? Just their, reduces their money, doesn't it? We'll stay blockading them, because why not right now? Trade game, taxman. Oh, that's cool. Right. Why has that got worse? Is it because we're not in the whole province at all now? We're in a different one, yeah. Uh, so this can be upgraded to get more public order. Chieftain's Hall. And I believe it's the third level of the Chieftain's Hall. Civic. Yeah, third one can get Herdmen. We get Chosen Warriors and Nordic Spearmasters, which are kind of our elite troops. Um, unfortunately, you can't get Huskars. That's... Separate to the dupes. We can get wolf coats. I'll oh, get North Norse Berserkers are good, but obviously very little armor. In fact, no armor. I don't think I think they're topless. So if we upgrade to the meeting hall and then go and get local traditions. Which is only over there. Then we can get the Great Hall and we can get Berserkers. I might do that. If I can protect them long enough, then when they charge out they'll go crazy. Right, we're going to leave things there for now, guys. So, um, Well, you know, actually, we'll throw in one more end turn phase as we're wrapping up. We'll see how it goes. Do, 
Do do do. So, so that's wrapping up nicely. Uh, Non-aggression pact. Yes. Well you. Sure. Your ancestors. Good. I'm glad they did. Long, long term. Imperium increase. That's always useful. What do we get? Two Imperium messages. Or is that just twice? I don't know. Ready for so we want normal stance. We don't want to be caught out in Force March. Though it's not such a bad thing anymore because it doesn't cause you to be ambushed. It's only if you're in uh, terrain, I think. And you've got to be in the ambush stance to ambush someone. Faction encountered the Roxolanians. Yeah. Metro Society and Hidden Agent. Alaric. Right. That is where we're going to wrap up for now, so I do hope you enjoyed this part. Don't forget to comment, subscribe, follow me on Facebook and Twitter, take part and join the Legion. All links are in the description. That was fast. Until next time, ciao for now.